All of me is Miko is impossible. Miko is my name is Taffrey16, and welcome back to another reaction video, and welcome to my third reaction to Chuckle Vision. So, my last reaction to this was a little over three years ago, actually. I believe it was December 17th, 2019, during my first ever Christmas month. And I did an episode, a Christmas episode of Chuckle Vision, but it was an older one where they were, like, when the show was in studio, and some people didn't like that, like, oh, you shouldn't do an in-studio episode. So today, we are doing what people originally asked me for three years ago. Uh, we're going to do actually two specials. They are called Me Messy Xmas and Christmas Chuckle. They both premiered one after another almost exactly 20 years ago on December 24th, 2002. I'm doing both of them because a piece, they're only like 14 minutes. So combined, they're still only only 28 minutes long, which is still makes probably one of the shorter videos I've done this entire month. <laughs> and we're doing two episodes. So let's go ahead and watch them. And we are off. These are pretty good quality, too. Is that a rhino? Alright. Messy X. How they score this job? Back to work? I am working on my Chuckle Mark Four snowmaking machine. We're supposed to be making Christmas toys. I know, but our working on this machine of mine is going to change the said Christmas for millions of people around the world. By them not getting any presents? No, <laughs> by giving them what they want, a white Christmas. How does it work? Well, this is where the water goes easy. This is the freezer compartment, okay. and there's the nozzle, and then you've got it. What have you got? This. Oops. Sorry, Droopy. I kind of did it. Well, you are now. <laughs> Ten seconds to get back out here and start working, or I'm reporting you to Santa for time wasting. But he said it'd be all right. He didn't. He did. He didn't. He did. I didn't. Told you. Silence. Elves bickering. By my beard, I've never heard anything like it. What well, if I might interject with a reasoned argument? What? It was his fault. <laughs> no, it was not. Yes, it was. Tell him, Barry. Tell him what? We're going to miss our Christmas deadline if these two don't start pulling their weight. Is this true? Have you been letting your work build up? Well, not in so many words. How many words? Just the one. Yes. Well, it's not good <laughs> enough. There's a lot to do. Now, why don't you be good elves and go out there and do it? But I'm warning all of you, I won't have any arguing and there'll be no slacking. Now, move Yeah, yourselves. no slacking. Sad I can't believe this. The chicanery. They, up, don't they? they do. And they all need finishing off. Yeah. I'll paint you pack. Oh. Hang on, I can't pack these. I'd be a bit more careful if I was you. Well, you're not, and I'm in a hurry. More haste, less speed. They're a mess. Have you ever seen a nose like that? Yes. Hey! Got him. What? Cop that out. You're supposed to be working, not messing about. Says who? Says me. Do uh -oh. you now? Well, Whoa. you're not in charge in here, <laughs> so you can keep that nose out. <laughs> Neither are you. <laughs> Bro, Paul's not playing around. Right! Oh no. You'll have to excuse him. He gets a bit tetchy when people criticise his work. I'll do more than criticise his work in a minute. <laughs> Pay him no heed, Barry. And you'll need some more paint. And you can tell him from me that he's no good threatening me. Because I was in the elving business long before he was a goblin. I was oh. never a goblin. I come from a long line of pixies. Ah. Want to make something of it? Uh, so you're at it too, eh? It was an accident. Well, if that's the way you want it, I'm going to report you both to Santa. No. You wouldn't. I would. You wouldn't. He would. 
I don't know what he I'm going to do with you. I've got a few suggestions. You see, I'm right in the middle of something at the moment, and I'm sure when I've finished it, you'll absolutely love it. I doubt it. The trouble is, you can't seem to work as part of a team. What with Christmas coming on, there's all these toys to get out. Otherwise, it can be ruined for everybody. Water. I always watch my beard at this time of day. Towel. Oh, no. Oh. Not Bluebeard the Pirate. What? You know your lovely long white beard? Of course. Well, it isn't. What? <laughs> Who gave me this towel? He did. He gave it to me. I didn't. You took it. Get out of here and go back to work. Well, what about us? Do you know something? I really don't care. Do what you like. <laughs> Sounds like a license to maim for me. <laughs> you guys have ruined Christmas. You know, it's not really that bad, isn't it? Oh, it, uh, it sort of makes you look younger. But I don't want to look younger. I want to look like me. Well, the paint's only on the end of your beard. Oh. Yeah, perhaps we could snip it off. Oh, do you reckon? Yeah, it's no problem. Scissors, Barry. Oh. Are you sure? Yes. Ah. Uh. Into it. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Well, actually, it doesn't look too bad with the light behind you. Oh. Right. You, I in that beard, and you stop annoying Elf Drippy and get out of here and do some work. Well, what do you want me to do? I don't care. All I want is a nice, relaxing bath. But I'm warning you, any more trouble with the elves, and I'll hold you personally responsible. Got it? Yes, got it. There'll be no more trouble. He's gonna get caned. Candy caned. Do you know, I never knew it was a false beard. Ah! Oh! It isn't! This one's real! That's for emergencies! Oh, sorry. Take that lot out and do it. Right, certainly. Right away. Now <laughs> for a nice, relaxing bath. Okay, yeah, that's one way going about it. You'd think Santa would have a better bath, but... Where are you going? Well, you heard him. You don't care what I do, as long as I don't upset the others. Fat chance of that. You can't yeah. help yourself. And if you do, you'll be out of the door before you can say Jack what's it. Well, I know that, but I can't upset anybody if I keep out of the way, can I? How are you going to do that in a place this size? Easy. If you want me, I'll be in the novelty research room. Well, that's all very well for you. I've got a beard to iron. And, and you burnt it. Uh, I've got You're a screwed. problem. We've all got problems, Barry. Mine's a snowmaking machine. What's yours? Harry. How did that happen? I left the iron on. He was in a bad mood to start with. What state is he going to be in when he sees this? Yeah. You don't let him see it. How can I stop him? Point taken. Try the scissors. Maybe I should just own up. After all, he is a reasonable man. Right, you lot. I'm going to get some hot water for my bath. And no slacking. Oh dear. If he sees that, he'll be in no mood to see what I've made. We're going to have to fix it. What with? Where are we going to get some white hair from round here? Everywhere. That'll do nicely. What do you want? Um, nothing. Good. Now go away. Just go in. Grab some quick. Won't he miss it? Not if you're fast. All right, if you're sure. I meant the cotton wool. Oh dear. Boy, that's my hair. What do you think you're playing at? We only borrowed it. We'll see what Santa has to say about this. Stalling money. How? Use your initiative. Hey, <laughs> you haven't seen my initiative, have you? <laughs> I insist on seeing you. What is it? I've come to tell you that something has got to be done about these two. Just a minute ago, this one cut my hair off. Oh, stop your moaning. You needed a haircut anyway. Now get back in there and get some work done. Elf Chuckley has got all my support. Oh, does he indeed? Well, all right then. I'll let it go this time, but if anything else happens, we're going on strike. Oh. 
And he's serious this time. I'm sorry about that, Santa. It won't happen again. It's me! <laughs> that fooled him. What are you doing? Fool Santa him too. impersonation is a sackable offence. Relax. Have you still got the hair? Yeah. Right. Let's get back in there and repair that beard. Hard at it. That's what I like to see. What happened to your hair? As if you didn't know. Ah! Is that beard ready yet? Ready? No, it's a bit of a whitey colour. It'll be ready in a couple of shakes of a lamb's tail. Good. Put it on. There. Perfect hey, fit. Perfect. Pass me the glue. What glue? Haven't we got any? Well, I haven't got any. Well, you better go and get some then, haven't you? Right. <sighs> Oh. Oh, oh, sorry. There you go. <coughs> now then, where'd I put me glue? <sighs> oh dear. Uh oh. Guess what I'm gonna do now? <laughs> Tell Santa. Correct. Bro, at this point, just throw down. Like, just. Here, pull this. You need to throw hands at this it's point, bro. Delayed action cracker, this is. Good. I think you better get back to the workshop. Drippy's on the warpath again. Or should I say, war chair? What? Yeah. Why didn't you say so? Here, stick this beard back together. I've got to see a man about an elf. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Here, put a bit more of this stuff into that other cracker. How much? All of it. Screw it, why not? <laughs> I want a word with you, Claus. Now what? Can't you see I'm planning my route? As leader of the Toy Makers Union, I'm here to tell you that I've had enough. And as of now, my members are downing tools until such time as you do something about those two. They're completely disrupting the work schedule. They're a couple of menaces. And I thought I told you they'd got my complete backing. Well, that was before. If there's any more hold-ups, we'll be lucky to make enough toys for Christmas. It doesn't matter anyway. The brainy one's got some great ideas for Christmas novelties. It'll change Christmas forevermore. Which one of you wants the beard? Oops, I'll come back when it's not so busy. Ah, wait for me! I'm coming with you! <laughs> right there! Now, you're for it. Yeah. I think I'm owed some sort of an explanation. What's been going on around here? A lot. So, you're telling me you've invented a machine uh. that makes snow, only it doesn't work? A bit like them. Uh. Revolutionise Christmas indeed. Even the crackers don't work. It's got a delayed reaction. Hey, this will impress him, Barry. You did remember to put the extra teaspoon of powder in, don't you? Teaspoon? Ah, did it. Run, Barry. Yeah, run. Oh my god. <laughs> Christmas. Yeah. We've ruined Christmas. We've ruined Christmas. Oh, it was all hey, a dream. Hey, 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 wake oh. up. What's oh. the matter with you? I've had this horrible dream. There was this bad-tempered Father Christmas and a nasty elf. There, there, Barry. It was only a dream. Oh. Gee up, Agnes. Trot on, Horatio. And no slacking. Or Wait, was it? Get back to sleep. He's coming. Ho, ho, ho. Where are you going? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> there's bloopers, that's awesome. No, but how working on this machine of mine is going to revolution... revolution revolution I don't know. What's my line? <laughs> <laughs> I know that. Better than... Yes. I'm just going to say, well, tell them. <laughs> that's great. And there we go. Bing, 
Dude, that sounds like wild. Christmas chocolate. Oh. 100,049. Two there, 50. 100,051. 100,052. 100,053. 100,054. 100,055. Oh, Jesus. 100,056. missing oh no i'm sure there was one more oh well one bruh two three four ah i've been looking forward to this all day nice cup of tea hey ah. get that shirt but put back on that top shelf and be quick about it it's very valuable that be careful it's only sherbet Correction, Barry. Super chuckle sherbet. Whoa. It's very powerful. Watch. Jeez. What are you doing? You put sherbet in my tea. It's ruined now. No, not to worry. I'll take it out of your wages. Uh, what? Hold on. <laughs> Parcel for Mr. Chuckle. That's me. Nice present. It is, isn't it? Who's the lucky person? Me. Isn't it about time you shut up? What? The shop. After all, it is seven o'clock on a Christmas Eve. We're not going to get any more customers now, are we? Yeah, I suppose you're right. Don't forget to be up bright and early in the morning. Oh, good. So I can open my presents? No, so you can open up the shop. So much for Christmas. Mm. Oh, this is like a Christmas carol. <laughs> This won't be the last Christmas Carol I do this month, either. Since there's a million and five adaptations. Sorry, Santa. Great bed, Christmas. Ooh, what good did Christmas ever do for anybody? I have a feeling you're about to find out. And... Oh. Uh oh. Meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom. There we go. Who are you? I am the ghost of Christmas past. I don't believe in Christmas. But others do, <laughs> and you did. No, I never did. What are you doing? You're going on a journey. You're going to yoink. To your Christmas past. Christmas past. Ain't Christmas brilliant? Yeah, you crackers. I know. What'd you call me? I win. Ooh. Uh. How do I look? <laughs> uh. Merry Christmas, Paul. Ah! Oh. Oh boy. Ah! Paul! Paul! <laughs> Are you all right? Barry! Is that you? Of course it is. Oh, thank goodness. I've got some wonderful news. I've seen the light. Well, you can't miss it. It's over there on the wall. <laughs> no, 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 no. About Christmas. It is a time for fun and merriment. And most importantly, a time for sharing. Why the sudden change? I've been back to the mansion where we grew up. We never grew up in a mansion. I've been visited by a ghost. I don't believe you. He said I've got to be kinder to you. I believe you. Yeah. Let's celebrate. We'll start by preparing a Christmas dinner. Great. I'll go and buy the biggest turkey I can find. Yeah. I'll start making the pudding. Hey, Barry, this is going to be a Christmas to remember. It is already. <laughs> 
didn't even need the other two ghosts. Show how generous I am. Could have had my eye out then. Sorry. See, you've got the tree then. Well, almost. Hey, I've got a turkey as well. <laughs> now we're ready for a feast. Oh. Well, Beautiful. maybe I like snack. <laughs> Never mind. You start decorating the tree. No. I'll go and get some more wood for the stove. Oh, no. Don't you want me to do that? No, Barry. I'll do all the hard work from now on. Peace and goodwill to all men. For today, at least. Bury the things in there. Yes? I wonder, sir, if you might spare a little Christmas sustenance for an unfortunate gentleman down on his luck. I know. I won't be a minute. There you go. Merry Christmas. Thank you, sir. And a Merry Christmas to you. God bless us, everyone. Dinner. Great. The turkey's almost ready. And the pud's all done. Oh, yes. I meant to tell you about that. Someone just came to the door. Yes. They said they were hungry and wanted something to eat. Go on. So I gave them the pudding. You what? I thought we'd help someone worse off than us. Well, they're certainly not now. All our life savings were in that pudding. What? I put it in as a surprise. Right. That's it. Christmas over. Oh. Shit. That was a dream. I don't believe in ghosts, I don't believe in Christmas, and I certainly don't believe in you. But peace and goodwill. You can take your goodwill and leave me in peace. <laughs> Bars. Bruh. Oh. Whoa. I am the ghost of Christmas present. No, no, you're a dream. Can a dream do this? <laughs> I've learned my lesson, <laughs> I promise. Prove it. Be good to your brother, Barry. I will. I'll cook dinner and we'll have lots of fun and merriment. <laughs> Great. Pardon? Uh, I mean, better go and make the preparations then. I'll just go and tell him. He'll be thrilled. Do that. Uh, hang on. Um, you'd better clean the sweets up first. You're right. And do you know what the ghost did next? <laughs> I've no what? idea. He tipped a jar full of lollipops all over me. They weren't lollipops. They were rhubarb and apple bonbons. How do you know that? Have a gobstopper. Oh, thank you. Stupid thing. Now get them lot picked up. <sighs> Why don't you come and have a nice relax, Paul? Hmm? Come over here and sit down in the chair. Huh? Now you just relax. I'll go and get a dustpan and brush. <laughs> that Barry. <sighs> uh oh. oh. Ah, what do you want? I am the ghost of um, cleaning things up. This Christmas you must be good to Barry. Of course. Give it to me. I'll do it. I'll be watching you. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. I couldn't find the dustpan. Don't worry about it, I've sorted it myself. Hey, Paul, there was a big present in the shed. Uh, yes, uh, just a little gift for myself. For Christmas. I got you a card. <laughs> Thanks very much. Did you get me anything? No. Oh. Nothing at all? No. You can only milk this for so long, buddy. Whoa! Whoa. Ah. You again? No, I'm a different one this time. Ah. I am the ghost of um, giving Barry a proper present. Who? What can I give him? Perhaps this will give you a clue. The bike's mine. Whoa! All right, all right, but leave me alone. Catch you eventually. Happy Christmas, Barry. 
For me? What can it be? Yeah. I'll give you a clue. He's got his own seat and a chain. You haven't. I have. You haven't. I have. My very own lavatory. Yeah. No. Mike, <laughs> it's a present for both of us. It's a shame it's snowing out. I know. You clear the snow from the alley and we're going to circuit round the shop. You clear it yourself. You come and relax and put your feet up. I'll clear the snow. Oh, well, if you're sure. Yes. Hey, hang on a minute. What? I know your game. What? You want to clear the snow so you can have first go on the bike. Ah, you've caught me. <laughs> I'm not stupid, you know. No. <laughs> Really beam done. Great bike, Paul. Shame the ghosts and I had to have it all day. Yes. Never mind, eh? Boy. Oh no. That stay no good. Dinner's almost ready. Great, I'm starving. How about an appetizer? I know the very thing. Chuckle Super Sherbet. It's been yoinked. That's funny. Go, Barry, go. Uh oh. Uh. <laughs> I'll give him ghost. This is one Christmas. I'm really going to get what I deserve. Yeah, you sure did. Whoa. Ah! <laughs> I am the ghost of Christmas future. I don't believe you. And it's going to be a bleak future. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Give it away, my life savings. That was an accident, too. How about pretending to be all those ghosts? Just a bit of fun. <laughs> what? Oh. It's no good there. hiding. Ah! <laughs> what? Uh, hang on. What's this? Me money. I thought you put it in the pudding. I did. Huh. No, you didn't. This must be what you put in the pudding. Chocolate coins. Uh, oh. uh, Merry Christmas, Barry. Merry Christmas. <laughs> and so Mr. Paul and Mr. Barry had learned the lesson of Christmas. They continued to live and work in peace and goodwill and extended kindness and consideration to their customers and those less fortunate than themselves. Did they? And within six months, they were bankrupt. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Is there more bloopers? Yes. Happy birthday, Barry. What about Christmas? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose you're right. Somebody's pinched the cash register. I thought we'd help someone worse off than us. Well, they're certainly not now. That pudding contained our life savings. <laughs> not funny. Put <laughs> a smile off your face. Oh, man, the bloopers are great. Okay, that was definitely the most wholesome thing I've watched this Christmas. The bloopers were fantastic. Uh, big shout, by the way, to Chuckle Vision Entertainment, who is a YouTube channel that... Uh, not an official YouTube channel, but a YouTube channel that put... Pretty much every episode of this show ever uh, on YouTube in good quality, too. Plus uh, a bunch of uh, live specials as well. His most viewed video is the Chuckle Brothers and Spooky Goings on live show. That could be something to look for in the future. Uh, and I'll have to remember this if I need any more episodes of it. Well, uh, there's a lot of episodes of this show, obviously. So, I mean, it looks like it's got 20 plus series. How many episodes did it have in total? 292. Wow. Um, so if anybody has any episodes uh, in particular to recommend for the future, I will do so. Uh, that was, I, I think, a pretty good, pretty good Christmas feature there. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. But that is going to do it for my, I guess, third total reaction to Chuckle Vision. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to leave a like. If you didn't like it, don't. If you want to follow any of my social media links, my Twitch, I stream every single day. My second channel, Free 16 Views, my Twitter. If you want to follow me on my Patreon, if you want to support me on my daily motion, all things in the video description down below, as well as the Twitch Files channel and the community Reddit. Uh, also in the video description, you can find the names of all my Patreons. For those of you that know, you can be Patreon on me for as well as $1 or £1. Uh, and you get access to the reaction videos, as well as the comments up to date early. 
sometimes more. With all that being said, though, my name is Taffrey. This has been my third Total Reaction Chuckle Vision. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.